Hi guys, it's September 21 today, so um, around 7 o'clock. I think I feel a little contraction, so I was like suspecting I my water broke, but unfortunately when we came here, um, it was negative, but um, we were surprised that um, I was already having the labor. I didn't know why I had the labor. I had some cramps, but uh, my back pain as well. So I was more concerned about having the water like gushing. So it was wrong that I, I suspected it was the water. So I was so scared. It's like telling my husband maybe we can call the doctor. But then um, we can't get through our doctor. So um, we called the hospital. I went to I went to emergency, and um, they were checking everything. It was I felt so nervous, but everything was so friendly. And um, the nurse uh, checked my cervix. I was already um, five cent centimeters dilated. So she said, "Okay, you cannot go anywhere. I think uh, you just don't know that you're in labor, so you need to hold on you." And yeah, right now I'm in um, labor and delivery room here in HEB um, Texas Health. So yeah, I have my IVs already. So I thought it was too bad. And I also did my COVID test. I think they're getting hold for the anesthesiologist to put an epidural. An epidural. So update, it's already 3.32 in the afternoon. Um, they gave me a uh, well, first dose of pitocin and I had my epidural with me. And yeah, I'm still five centimeters. So let's see yeah. my progress. Yeah, I have my peanut oil here. Yeah, so I'm also drinking my water. Oh, they actually um break my water. I think at around two o'clock, and then they put pitos um epidural, and then now first batch of pitos in. It's 0.5 centimeters. It's already 4.52 in the afternoon. This is waiting for the baby. Baby. Mm, that's where he will be, honey. is painful or was it you thought epidural would be painful mm, no not so painful yeah, I, I, I here no. I have my blood pressure and then I had my pitocin went back So here on the screen, the blue line represents the um, the heartbeat, Marcus' heartbeat. The purple is April's heartbeat, and the and the yellow line below is the what is it? Contractions. contractions is the level of contractions. Down here we have 
Marcus heartbeat, April's pressure, blood pressure, pretty low, 104 by 58, well, 104 by 58, your blood pressure, mm, heartbeat is 80, and here in the meds she's receiving through IV. Okay, at around 6.30, they check my dilation, so I'm already 7 centimeters, 90% uh, efface, and negative 1, so the baby's down there. So it's all already 6.59, almost 7, so they're gonna check me again after 2 hours. To check if I progressed. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay, good breath. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Marcus? Marcus. They always love this because they just like their hands. This is like being back home. <laughs> Kind of enjoyable. Mm -hmm. This is just to kind of try and get some of that amniotic fluid and anything else that could be in his hair out. I know. I know. Oh. He's so cute. 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 He's so c
But if we start to do that, what we'll start to do is slowly slip your breast out of his mouth, mm -hmm. and then he'll have just that tip. Mm -hmm. So as long as you can either hear him breathe, or if you feel like you really want to, I want you to get way up here. Where are you going? Mm -hmm. Oh, look at him go. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Get a picture of all three of you guys? That'd be great. <laughs>